Hey guys, welcome back to another week of What's for Dinner. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, grocery hauls, what's for dinner, and recipes. And we are kicking off another week of What's for Dinner with some good old Sam's Club pizza. We had to pick up a few things today and I did not feel like making dinner. So we both got pepperoni pizza from the snack bar. So here it is. And we have had Costco and Sam's Pizza, and we definitely prefer Sam's Pizza. However, a little disappointed that the crust is so flat. Normally their crust is big and fluffy, but um, I don't know if they didn't let it rise enough or what. But anyway, this is what's for dinner tonight, and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, let me show you what we are having for dinner tonight. This is a meal that uh, we have pretty often. I've had it before on other What's For Dinner videos. It is this Margaritaville Jammin' Jerk Shrimp with uh, Jamaican spices. And here it is. There's basically two servings in a box. And so um, I am serving my shrimp over jasmine rice. And that seasoning that you see, that blackening, is just from the shrimp. I'm just from sauteing it in the pan. There it is, too, but it's just kind of just kind of clunked up, for lack of a better word, but it's so good. And then we are eating some leftover green beans, and we are also finishing off these Sister Schubert's yeast rolls. I had two in the bag in the freezer, and you guys know that I am working on trying to use stuff out of my freezer so and pantry. So anyway, this is what's for dinner tonight, and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so here is another meal from our freezer. I made this pulled barbecue chicken. Um, I made it with boneless, skinless chicken thighs. A while ago, we didn't eat it all, and so I threw it in the freezer. So I took this out, and we are having some um, pulled barbecue chicken served on some toasted hamburger buns. We had some chips in the pantry that we needed to eat. So this is my plate. And this is Howard's plate. He has the same thing, except he added cheese to his. And I think he has like some, um, some mayo stuff. Oh, here it is. Um, he brought it over for me. So he's added, he added this Chipotle mayo on his sandwich, which you guys know, I'm not a big mayo fan at all. And these are the chips that we are having. Um, we've never had these before. Pocky spicy queso and they're pretty good, but I am excited because we are eating stuff that we already have on hand. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, we are having a quick and simple meal today. Again, you know I'm using stuff in my freezer. In my freezer we had a few slices of bread um, and so I decided to make grilled cheese sandwiches. So here they are, or here it is right here. And then um, I had to run an errand after work and I love tomato soup with my grilled cheese. And so I stopped by Zoe's Kitchen and I love their tomato basil soup. So we are going to have some of their tomato basil soup as well. So this is what's for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, so we are continuing the freezer challenge and we are having chicken nuggets. I have a, had a couple of boxes of these Tyson chicken nuggets in the freezer. So chicken nuggets. And then I also had some frozen corn in the freezer, <clears throat> excuse me, um, from Aldi's. And so here it is. Just added a little bit of butter, salt and pepper to it. And then we had a little bit of leftover mashed potatoes from the Mississippi pork roast um, that I made. So this is what's for dinner tonight and we'll see you guys next time.